time to hunt you down. That wasn't so bad. Time to hunt you down. Nobody here to Okay, never mind. Here they are. Keep on moving, friends. Wow. Weapons. We walk on safe ground. Thanks. Side, we must hurry. Oh my god, what the hell is that? Oh my god. For fuck's sake, just go in position. What are you doing this for, Ingvar? Why must you buy for such power? Throne is not something you're entitled to, Ingvar. 
The people have the right to choose their leader. They chose the Borvalders. They've done nothing but provide wisdom and help. While your family does nothing but cause trouble for the people. How did you get your people to follow you so loyally? You promised him power, didn't you? You would get the heart and use it to help him. You lied to your people. That is the first thing that a king can do. You betrayed your city. How could you possibly hope to rule all of Falskar? Stand here being assailed by your pity. Nar, you've lost all this time. Oh, no. We have to do something. We must stall him. Duel me. You heard me. I am challenging you to a round of combat. No guards. None of my companions. Just you and me. Agnar. If you have a single drop of honor in your blood, you'll accept or forever be known as a coward. <laughs> Fight? I'll play your little game. But fighting an old man wouldn't be much of a challenge, now would it? No. I want to fight the Traveler. They come waltzing through the gateway, supposedly foretelling some grand trend. Certainly they must be special. He will provide a challenge. Do I want to fight him? You must do it. Don't worry. You aren't a Nord, but you must still have some code of honor. You must fight Ingvar in my stead. But do not fight for your honor. Fight for the honor of the people of Falskar. This is going to be fun. <laughs> Oh no. What the? Ingvar's screams echoed through the great cavern as Akrandin swooped down and carried him away, tearing not only at his body, but his very soul. Agnor gently placed the heart of the gods back upon its pedestal, and the chamber was resealed. Our efforts that day had paid off. Ingvar and Valder was dead. A land free of his family's endless conquest for power. But not all was won on that day. Borvald lay in ruin, as did Stalgard. Two mighty blows that may mean darker times yet awaited the land. But that was not our concern right now. For on this day, Falskar was saved, thanks to the valiant efforts of our king, his people, and the Traveler, an outsider whose involvement in these events was destined by the gods themselves. The people may continue to live, to farm, their children can once again play in the forests, and while the land is not without issue, it has a moment to live, and to enjoy. Falskar is safe, for now. Cool.
cool mod. you that the scholars of Valskar will remember you. Brother Dorlo will make sure of that your deeds are more than mere legend. Now please, have some ale. Listen to Rurik play his songs. Relax. You have earned it. We have all earned it. This is Sing. a song that arose so that we may never forget the virtuous feet of the king, his three Nordsmen. I still can't believe what happened to Dorlo. Fine day. Are you a hunter? If not, you should try it. Tracking your prey, outsmarting them, closing Hello! Do you need anything? You're right. Every one of them loves what I made so far. You've been so helpful to me. Not meant that I'd be willing to trade with you right now. Thanks again for everything you've done for me and Otman. We really do appreciate it. Guys? So I think I'm done here. For now, I think I'm done with the quest. Yes, sir. Funk Soul quest line is done. I want to do this Dreams of Oblivion adventure. I wonder. I need to collect one more. One more fragment. Yeah, I'll check that.